Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Today we got the X100 Infinity Wing by 3D Air Venture. We're going to take it up for another flight. Uh, if you guys haven't seen my build video, make sure to check that out. I'll have a link in the description below. Also, you can purchase the STL files from the link below. Uh, if you guys saw my build video at the end of it, some of you guys commented on the takeoff for the main flight. Uh, it was a little bit of a handful. Uh, I actually got a little closer to the ground than even that. I'm going to show you guys a clip of the main flight. Check this out. So as you guys can see, that was a pretty uh, close uh, takeoff on the maiden flight. Uh, you know, basically what happened was I just basically as pilot air, I just full throttle on the stick and it just took right off right away. Uh, pitched up, basically stalled, uh, dropped on the wing. And then uh, I was able to just hold full power in and just fight out of it and uh, get it back up and flying. So today we're gonna try to use the landing gear a little bit more and get a little bit more of a ground roll, do a newer, more gradual takeoff, uh, get some more speed built up and then uh, let it take off that way. So once it got in the air, uh, it actually flew really good. Uh, as you can see, uh, it was just flying really, really well. I was able to do some rolls with it and everything. So they're gonna take it up today and fly it some more and practice the takeoff, practice a little bit of landings and uh, have some fun with it. A bunch of you guys were asking about the CG on this plane, super important. That's one of the reasons why I didn't like crash it on the main is because I had the CG set right. So there's a little carbon fiber spar here. That's about 45 millimeters in front of the trailing edge as a wing. And so that's right about where I have the CG set at that. And that's nice and balanced right there. I do have to have a little bit bigger battery. Like I said in the build video, uh, it's a little bit bigger battery, but the CG is right. So make sure you got the CG set before you take this plane up in the air. This X100 Infinity Wing by 3D Air Venture is fully 3D printed. You can purchase SDL files uh, from the link in the description and you guys can uh, print one of these out for yourself at home. And then I have a full step-by-step -step directions on how to assemble this entire airplane and get it ready for flight. So you guys can check that out. Uh, this airplane with a 4-cell 4 4,000 4, milliamp battery came in with a ready-to-fly weight of 1800 grams. And this uh, entire airplane is printed out of regular PLA. Uh, you can print this entire thing with uh, lightweight PLA with a few PLA parts uh, and save quite a bit of weight and you'll be able to use a little bit smaller battery which will save a lot of weight also. Uh, and then also 3D Air Venture recommends you could print this out of like a hybrid system. We can print like the rear wing with lightweight PLA and the front wing and the fuselage out of PLA. Uh, so just kind of a lot of options to set up whatever uh, kind of airplane you want with what power system you want to use. Uh, so lots of different options there. So thank you guys so much for watching this video and we will see you guys in the next build.